Hey yo, what's up guys? How are you guys doing? Some Manipuri and high words, which is exact same meaning. Not tokochai. Yay? Hey? Did I say tokochai? How do you guys say matchbox? My kit. In Thai language, we say my kit. Hey yo, what's up guys? How are you guys doing? Ah, don't freak out with my cap, alright? And don't freak out with my people. I'm very the gap because I have pimple issue. <laughs> if I open it, you will freak out more. So don't toko chai. Yay? Hey? Did I say toko chai? Yes, exactly. I said toko chai. <laughs> Do you feel like something familiar to you and your language when I say toko chai? Yeah, uh, let's find out what tokajai means in my language. Uh, yes, yes, yes. So. so, so, so today. Oh, sorry. <laughs> welcome. Welcome back to May Nampish. May Nampish. I was about to, you know, play a Thai joke. So it's like this. Hi guys, welcome back to Menam Push. Hi, Menam Pack. Hi, Menam Pitch. Hey, it's correct. <laughs> it's a tight joke. To box, to box. Like that. <laughs> Crazy. I already wrote it down some words, some Manipuri and Thai words, which is similar and not even similar. Some words are exact same meaning, you know? So let's get started with the first one. I visited Ima market last time. The first one starts with Ima. Ima in your language means mother, rich, even in Thai language. Ima also means mother. We have three ways to call mother. First is Ima. Second, mama. Third is me. So me is more like Thai, and those families who have like Chinese blood or the old generations from Chinese, they would call their mother as mama. And most of Thai Northeast, we call mother as ime or ima again. You're like me cha me. Me is the good, okay? Second word is father. You guys call father as ipa, baba, right? Ipa, baba. Even in Thai also, we call three way as well the same. So first, ipa. Yeah. Second, baba. And last one is pa. So first one mostly from northeast of Thailand side, we say. Iho. Second, Baba, more like Chinese Baba. And Pa, it's more like Thai, very Thai. Like, Pa Ja Me Ja. Iho Me Yang Yu. Yeah, like this. And Ba Ma. Ba Ma. There's no Baba Ma here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, the third one is. Pillow. How do you guys say pillow? Huh? Mon? Mon, right? Mon, mon, mon. Yes. This is my mon. Yes. Mon pillow. Mon pillow. Mon pillow. Mon pillow. Even in Thai language, you should say mon as a pillow. Yeah, say mon. Is it weird? I don't know, but we should say mon. Yeah. One, two, three, okay. Fourth. You guys say incense stick as a duke. Duke, right? But we say to. What? Is it similar, really? Yeah. Alright. <laughs> I, I ran down to get to. So. <coughs> Okay, so we Buddhist pray God using three to like this. Alright. Next one, number fifth is 
dust. How do you say dust? Mm, ifun. Yeah? Yeah. In Thai language, we say fun. No, e. Only fun. Fun. Like, hachi. Hachi. Fun. Say fun, yeah? Next is matchbox. Matchbox. How do you guys say matchbox? Eh. I love you ever bring matchbox. Matchbox. Yeah. Matchbox. And this is how my matchbox looks like. How do you guys say matchbox? My kit. Right? In Thai language, we say my heap. I'm sorry. Thai, we say my heap. So similar, right? Yeah. Okay, seven. That is pee. Peeing. Um, when Thai people want to pee, we will say like, I want to she. <laughs> she means peeing. I asked my friends and they said that she, mostly for infant, to build their feelings to feel like peeing or something like that. Right? So we also do the same. Shh. Is it similar? Number eight. Let's go for fruits now. Alright, so. How do you call grapes? How do you say? Angur. I don't know whether I pronounce it correct or not. Like, angur. In my language, we say angun. Angun. We also have ng alphabet. So, na angun. Similar. Exactly. Similar. Okay, let's go for a second fruit. How do you say litchi? I, I miss litchi now. I want to eat litchi. Now. Okay, when do you say litchi? How do you, hey, Michelle, how do you say litchi? Okay, some of you guys say litchi and renchu. We Thai people also say lin si. Lin si. Finally, coming to the last word, that is elder sister. How do you call elder sister? You call J, right? J, J. J and then following with the name, right? It's exact same as in Thai word. Yeah, but I have to let you know that J is more like Chinese. So Thai, we say P, P, Sean, P, N, P, Me. But in some families who have mixed with Chinese, we also say J the same, like Jen, 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 Jen. Oh shit, I forgot. <laughs> she already left. That was 10 similar words between Manipuri and Thai language. What do you feel? Is this really similar? Yeah. And I was really really shocked when I, you know, first heard like people say Mon Pilo. I was like, what? You call so wait, 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 wait. Hang on, hang on, calm down. Okay, I was like, what do you also call mon or what? It's so similar. I was like, oh my gosh, oh my god, oh my god, so excited. And you know, there are still two more, two more words that I found out that's so similar. Maybe it's a little bit different meaning. But yeah, let's listen. Zambra. Zambra is a layman, right? That I visited last time. I also show you guys and um, we'll call out this bra in your email market. In Thai language, you say this bra as a Thai flowers. We say zambra, 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 zambra. So not too low. And the second one is tokujai. You guys mostly use tokujai as like disgusting. Tokujai. It's tokujai, right? But for us, for Thai language, you say tokujai as a Shock! You are not expecting that some days it's like this. Oh shit! I'm tokujai. Like this. Oh shit! I tokujai. Nah, like that. That's it. <laughs> hey, yo, yo, I think that's enough for this video. And anyone is watching this video and you feel like, hey, oh, these words are so similar to your language. 
Even if it's not Manipuri language, I mean another language. You can write a comment down below, alright? It would be really interesting. And also please like, share, like, share, subscribe, and share. Thank you for watching. I forgot to say sorry, guys.